this video, we are going to review how to configure and track an instrument such as a liquid handler and clarity lens. If you click on the eye icon in the upper toolbar, you will find that there is a walk me of how to add a new instrument. In this video, we are going to manually add the instrument to a step. If you click on configuration, then consumables, and then instruments. This will be the space that we configure the instrument type. To add the new instrument type, you will click the green new instrument type button. You have to give the type a name and a vendor. If you do not see the vendor in the dropdown, you can directly type into this field and it will add a new one. For this example, we're going to create a fleet of pre-lab Hamiltons and the vendor will be Hamilton. Then we'll click save. From here, we will add the individual instruments that should belong to this type. First, you're going to click New Instrument, and each instrument will need a name. The only mandatory field here is instrument name. However, you also have the option to add a serial number, an expiration date, software name and version. Then you can click save. To associate the instrument with the step, we will click back into the instrument type and then under instrument type, you select which master step you would like this to be seen on. We're going to associate this Hamilton fleet with the mRNA purification and fragmentation step. and then click Save. Now, if we toggle over to the step and refresh, we can see that there is now an option for the instrument used. The caveat to the instrument configuration is that you can only associate one instrument per step. So if you want to track a liquid handler and a thermocycler on one step, one could be configured as an instrument and one could be configured as a step custom field. Being able to track which instrument has performed which step on which specific samples will help to troubleshoot and analyze your preps over time. 